On a visit to the former Gulag state of Kyrgyzstan in 2019, I confirmed an elderly woman. She was baptized in infancy, but due to Soviet persecution, her parents would not risk confirmation. We wept as I conferred the sacrament. The Catholics of Kyrgyzstan, many the grandchildren of believers, deported to that land and imprisoned for refusing to abandon their faith, remain inspirational witnesses of Jesus Christ. You provide vital Catholic ministry by giving to the collection for Central and Eastern Europe when it is taken up in your parish. The collection helps Catholics in many nations, but few have greater need than Kyrgyzstan. Around 1980, the balconies of this tiny cathedral were built in secret by Catholics who risked arrest so that more people could worship. Today, young adults pray the rosary as reverently as their grandparents. The church gives food and necessities to the poor of all faiths. She assists alcoholics in recovery and women with crisis pregnancies. Though evangelization is illegal, every act of service by the Catholics of Kyrgyzstan is a witness of God's love and the dignity and purpose of every human life. Please join in that witness through a gift to the Church in Central and Eastern Europe collection and with prayers for the people of the region and those who minister to them.